Hey everyone, Tom here from the Blue Root team. In today's video, we're talking about how we can connect Facebook with our Zoho CRM. So what that looks like is we're really breaking it down into three steps. First is an introduction to Zoho Social and how to get that set up and integrated with your Facebook. Next, after that, we're gonna connect that Zoho Social account with your Zoho CRM account. Make sure those two are talking to each other. And then finally, what we're gonna do is we're going to route new lead forms from Zoho Social to Zoho CRM. And we're also going to write from the CRM, automate it so that anytime someone interacts with your brand on Facebook, that they're gonna come in. So those are those three steps we're gonna walk through. And it's a really cool feature and I'm really looking forward to it. So before we get started, please be sure to subscribe to the channel so you can get up to date with all the types of videos that we're putting out. Thanks so much. So when you're in your CRM and you want to connect your CRM to your Facebook, your Facebook leads, the first thing you'll actually do is go to a new tab and what you'll need to connect to is something called Zoho Social. So you can go to social.zoho.com or if some of you are familiar with the Zoho One tabs, so there's social, you can always so come to here and then of course click the social tab there and then it takes you to the same place. So once you're here, what you can see is that it's going to prompt you to connect to your Facebook account. And so you can click that and you can see it basically takes you to, you know, your typical Facebook login page to authenticate that connection. So once you have that authenticated, basically then what you can see here, this example of the blue root Facebook, but then you can see you'll start to get information coming in about, you know, followers, new followers, that sort of thing. And so that's how you know you're connected. So that's the first step there. After that, what you're gonna do, I'll quickly pause again. So this goes back to my CRM now. So now it's a matter of connecting my CRM to that Zoho social account. So I'm gonna go into my settings area. And the first thing I'm gonna do is actually go to my modules and fields, and I'm going to unhide the social account so the social module just make sure it's there so I look for it social it is checked off so we're good to go and I can see it down there um, and so it's activated so now we do have social as part of our CRM and then the last thing I'm gonna do then with this now that it's there what will show up now is this area here called social so I'll be able to click on it and give this a second to load and so when you click on this now you should be able to see that your brand is here so again here's the blue root example and that's based on the connection with Zoho Social. So now you have your Zoho Social connected to your Facebook and then your Zoho Social also connected to your CRM. So the CRM and the Facebook are now talking to each other. So then the final step is just making sure that every time you have someone who writes into one of your lead forms, something like that, they show up in the CRM. So to do that, what I'm actually going to do is I'm gonna go back to Zoho Social and I'm gonna click on the lead form tab. So going back to Zoho Social here, this is the blue root one. I'll click on the lead form itself. You can see we don't have any lead forms right now, but there's nothing here. But when they're here, there'll be an option to sync with the CRM. And so I, I just select that and that'll be good. So a quick example of what that looks like when it's all set up. Here's a sample account and you can see that basically here are all my lead forms and I have the option to connect to my Zoho CRM under the lead form there. So that's the first part of the connection, which is okay when someone writes into a lead form coming into here. And then the last part of the connection, I'll go back to the Blue Root branded one here. When I come into here, you can see there's also an option to automate some lead generation. So if I come over into here, and then you can see again, we have just another way to do it. So if you think what I just showed you is lead form, someone writes in, we can also have it if someone messages, comments, posts, whatever. So let's just say messages. I'll hit next. And then I can add them as a lead or a client. So these are two different modules. I usually like client, that's what we use and I can hit done and that's going to connect it as well. So what I've done there is now not just the lead forms come in, but also when someone interacts with my brand, I can bring them in and the same thing works for Twitter. So really that's the extent of it. So connecting social to Facebook and then social to CRM and then configuring the lead form and the automatic or automate lead generation settings. And by doing those two things or three things there, you should be good to go. Thanks.